Size Maker. I used an empty shampoo bottle that I had here at the house. Um, so I'm recycling really good. Um, and then I used to make the noises, I used color, <coughs> excuse me, I used colored pasta with the kids. Um, we dyed it a couple weeks ago and we had some left over, so I thought it would be a fun thing. The kids can see the different colors. And then I also used, I had a little disco ball here that I don't use. So I took the little square mirror pieces off of it and put it in there. So it's a fun glittery thing when the kids are shaking it around in the light. Um, you can also let the kids paint on the plastic or, you know, put stickers. I totally thought that this would be just a fun way for the kids to get involved if they made their own. So, yeah, that's my noise maker. Um, you can do it with whatever you want. You know, you can use buttons, sand, pebbles. Um, let the kids make their own. I thought that that would be a really good idea for um, sensory skills as well as um, they can listen to the difference of the items that are in there. You know, like pasta makes a different sound than the mirrors would, or the mirrors make a different sound than the bigger buttons. I thought that that would be pretty cool, and then they can also work on counting skills if you wanted to have them count how many items they were putting in. Um, and if this toy would be put in music and movement. And you can involve it in a lot of activities with that. So, yeah. And Shelly, thank you for letting me turn this in via email. I appreciate it. Bye.